this entire facility is one of the leading tourism destinations in this country. And while we deliberate on this isolated issue, there is the larger issue of the reputation of this facility. If you read tourism magazines from all the, 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 the uh, source markets, the United States, Britain, Europe, they all speak of the Oysters Bay Garden. This is an important facility. And this is a message at this point to remind the government of the need to constantly upgrade this facility. A lot more can be done. We are not being greedy, but a lot more can be done. It rests on one of the most beautiful beaches in Barbados. The people who come here don't have as much access to the beach as they should have because they don't know it. It, it, it doesn't open to the side that on which the beach is located. Uh, most Barbadians tend to look at the road, but there's a very beautiful beach behind here. And I am concerned about the reputation of this facility. This incident may have brought the reputation of the facility into some disrepute, and I want us to get past that. But I want to send a message to the government, and a very serious message, to continue to upgrade this facility. It must never fall below uh, the standards that we expect, because people are coming to Barbados, apart from the cave, they come to oysters.